Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm going to be continuing the bush plane series with episode number two. I'm still going to be featuring the Super Cub, and today we're going to be doing an early morning flight out to the Heron's Nest, um, which is a freeware scenery package that you can download from iBlue Yonder. So I will include a link in the description for that, as well as for the aircraft and the other plugins that will be used for the flight. Um, the uh, KO code for the Heron's Nest, I believe, is 00ME, but I don't believe it shows up unless you actually have that scenery package, uh, because it's a custom location, as if I understand uh, correctly. So, but it is freeware, so it's definitely worth taking a look at. Probably should have set the time a little bit forward. Because I doubt there's any lights at this location. But I guess that'll make it more interesting. should be able to see the lights out there now. That's actually for the seam lane, I believe. I will go all the way around the island before we land there, so you can see generally what's there.
sort of see the cut in the middle of the island there in the trees. That's uh, where we're going to, you know, where we're going to land. And I'm going to fly around to the uh, sea lane as well. So if you also have a float plane, you can uh, probably slide that here as well. And I believe there's a docking station around here too. Alright guys, so that's the Herod's Nest. And I'll try to do a takeoff here and I'll do a landing in the other direction as well.
All right, guys. So that's the Heron's Nest, and it's uh, zero zero M E, I believe, is the uh, code. And as I said, I will leave a link in the description. Um, and this is absolutely freeware, so you can go download this from the uh, I Blue Yonder website. And of course, the uh, Piper uh, Super Cub is payware, and I'll also leave a link in the description for that as well. Um, the next episode, I am going to switch aircraft. But I'm going to pick up from this same location and uh, do a little bit more flying from this area. So um, thanks for watching, guys. If you ever have you know questions, comments, suggestions, you can leave that in the comment section below. Or uh, as always, you can send an email if you wish. And uh, you know I can usually get back to uh, any messages within about a day or so. So uh, thanks for watching. Until next time, I'll see you guys later.